Presidential candidate Jeb Bush tweeted a photo of a FNX 45 pistol he received as a gift on Tuesday while he was visiting FN Manufacturing in Columbia, South Carolina. The tweet was accompanied with a one-word caption that read, America. This tweet set off a Twitter firestorm which included celebrities, NSA whistleblowers, and voters from all over the country reacting to Jeb's tweet and countering with their own vision of America. When a reporter asked Jeb about the tweet, he acted almost as if he didn't know the tweet had been posted and then defended the gun tweet by saying that gun manufacturers create lots of high-wage jobs in America. The purpose was he went to a gun manufacturing facility where lots of jobs are created, high-wage jobs, so I was receiving gun. That's about to Check out more of Crave's presidential campaign coverage, including Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton, reimagined as comic book heroes by the publishing company Storm Entertainment. Check out all of Storm Entertainment's Republican and Democratic presidential campaign comics available at the Comic Flea Market. Links are in the blog post by Bonnie Burton. And what if Facebook likes were votes? Then who would be the next president? Read the entire story about what they are calling the Facebook primary of presidential politics by Crave writer Michael Franco. Check out Crave at Crave.cnet.com. You can follow Crave on Twitter at Crave. And this week's Crave giveaway is another durable Timbuktu laptop backpack. This one's blue. Go to the blog and enter to win. We believe that if you augment humans with technology, humans should be able to do or would be able to do uh, much more. We thought that music is a great medium to try that. Uh, music is something that is very timely. Uh, you really need to do things on the right millisecond. It's also very spatial. You need to go to the right places. So what better medium than to try the concept of a third arm that would augment you and allow you to do uh, things that you couldn't before than music. And that's where the shared control uh, come to play and the whole idea of cyborgs, augmented humans. We believe that if you have something that is part of your body, it's a completely different feeling because it learns how your body moves and it can augment it. So if you want to move like you saw toward a particular drum, the arm knows that because it recognizes the gestures and you feel that your own body is responding to you in a way. The idea is that machines are not separate than human but are becoming part of a human.